once again with Kingpin. So, Hi. let's get to the point. This is our last app review subcategory, root, and then I'm going to start showing others. So, Rome Box Lite. This app has so many apps embedded in it, it is like amazing. So, uh, let's get down to basics here. Um, oh, like an app just. Um, this should have been edited. On this, every single app included. Um, so, the, all the things included, and then extra tools like BusyBox Installer, Roam to a Box Pro, and Super User. ADB Wireless as well, which I don't know what that means. Uh, then app info, change log, um, so as you can see what's new, um, this app is by, this is version 6.0.4, latest version, by J. Rummy Apps, um, written by Jared Rumler at J. Rummy 16, I think that that's an name. Uh, so tools overview. You have Rome installer, scripter, terminal emulator, DS changer, manager, configure ARPS to SD, and rebooter, which boots in every sort of way that you would think. It can shut down your device. It, uh, as you can see there. Okay. Uh, you have performance tools, CPU control, kernel tweaks, build prop editor, task manager, and SD booster. Uh, you have font installer, boot theme manager, status bar icons, and theme chooser and interface. And then that's basically it on the app. So let's go in to breaking this stuff down. Um, Rome installer, basically the same as the app called Rome installer. Uh, you install Rome's like manager and those other apps. App manager, you can freeze app, back up and restore apps, share apps, freeze and uninstall apps. Freeze means stop them from being used. Kill misbehaving apps, which sounds a little aggressive. Link any app to Google Play, send any app to the SD card, and much more. Root browser is the root system file browser. You can explore hidden files, folders, batch, copy, paste, zip, tar, and send and manage. Scripter uh, allows you to perform things. It's kind of like in Minecraft, you know how there's like um, that uh, thing that allows you to like um, kill yourself or whatever. Uh, yeah, terminal terminal emulator is the same thing as scripter. Uh, terminal emulator, by the way. Um, it allows you to do your own thing. Um, DNS changer, which is um, ad, you know, changing ads and stuff. Auto start manager, which are apps that start in the beginning. Apps SD would be apps being programmed. Now performance, CPU control, you know, uh, real basic. You can change some complicated stuff. So. It's not really base complicated, as you can see. You can slide this and change this. CPU profilers, benchmark, that sort of stuff. Kernel leaks. Um, uh, the app that we did, Samsung Galaxy S Kernel Tweaker, or Kernel Flash, or that install kernels, this is the actual kernel that you have that you can edit. Build prop editor, change the LCD density, VM heap size, sorts of complicated things. Task manager, really simple, SD booster as well. Um, font installer, you know, custom fonts. Boot animations, which are custom boots. Theme manager, status bar icons, and theme chooser. So yeah, all that basic stuff from there. Uh, 10 out of 10 for the app, it's really amazing. Um, well, uh, 9 out of 10 because it's the light version. The pro version's 10 out of 10. So uh, yeah, check this out if you have Root, really, it's one of the best apps. So um, don't forget to comment, subscribe, and um, just um, have fun in life. Uh, anything you want to say, Kingpin? Happy Minecrafting. Yep.